Hey Aquarius, welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Nelly, aka Awotero, and I'm here to give you guys a reading. We're going to tap into this energy. We're going to see what's coming towards you guys the next 24 to 48 hours. We're going to see what are the overall messages, intentions, and possible outcomes. But before we get started guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot, guys. Reverse the roles as need be. If the reading resonating, you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. Guys, don't forget to check out your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs for more additional messages and clarity regarding this reading. So I went ahead and I pulled out your oracle for the reading. There are a couple messages here that are coming out for you guys. But overall, I feel that somebody has gained a lot of knowledge regarding a situation, a past situation. Um, there's also some wisdom and clarity, strength, overcoming obstacles, recognition, recognizing where you made a mistake and what you want moving forward. And then there's this lover's energy here, a connection, a very passionate connection, shared visions and values. So I'm really getting here, guys, is that you're overcoming some obstacles with somebody from the past or someone that you're currently with. This is an energy of someone that you already know, okay? You're overcoming some obstacles with this individual. In the past, you and this person were not seen eye to eye. There was a lot of misunderstandings between you and your person. Um, a lot of back and forth, a lot of disconnect and a lot of confusion. And it was because at one point you and your person were very blocked. Neither one of you guys wanted to let your guard down. Both of you guys wanted to be right. You both wanted to run the show. Alpha male energy all the way between both you and your person. Okay. But I feel that maybe after some time of separation here, maybe a timeout, not a total breakup, but a timeout, you have been able to receive some type of wisdom, acknowledge gained through experience, or knowledge gained through experience. Or from a wise counselor. So there's some knowledge that you have um, received. Some wisdom. Some clarity that you have received in this time of separation here. Which is going to allow you and your soulmate, your lover, your partner to overcome some obstacles. Okay. And this is also recognition. That both you and this person are ready to sit down and take responsibility for your past actions. It's no longer only your fault, Aquarius, or it's no longer only their fault, Aquarius. But I feel that both you and this person are going to take full responsibility as to what you guys did in the past. Acknowledge your mistakes and really move on and move forward. This connection wasn't completely done. It was just kind of put on a pause, okay, is what I really got. It was put on a pause. But now you guys are overcoming some obstacles together, recognizing where you made your mistakes and moving on and moving forward. So let's see here. Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is the overall energy here for Aquarius and this person, please? Overall energy for Aquarius and this person, please. Overall energy for Aquarius and this person, please. Queen of Cups, Aquarius, you may be dealing with the water sign, but what I'm really getting here is that there is a lot of love between you and this individual. And with the world in the reverse, as I clearly stated previously, this connection wasn't done. It was just at a pause, okay? The love is mutual, okay? You love this person as much as they love you. I feel that you guys both care about each other very, very deeply, okay? Um, and finally, those blockages that once existed in the connection, they have been finally removed already, okay? And with the world in the reverse, it is it is acknowledgement that the connection wasn't done. It just needed some time. It needed a break. Both of you guys need to kind of cool off, move forward a little bit alone, and really come to the, to a determination that this, that this connection is worth the fight. With the Knight of Wands, someone's coming in with some passionate communication, with some clarity after a time alone in hermit mode. I feel both you and your person were in this mode. 
there is now an, uh, a spark in the connection once again, a reignitement in the connection once again, which is going to allow you and this person to move towards each other now and finally resolve these problems that were holding you back in the past. What happened here between Aquarius and their person, universe, archangel, spirit, angel, guides, and guardians? You guys stopped talking to each other. Okay, with the eight of wands, you guys stop communicating to each other. You both just assume that the other person automatically was a mind reader and they knew what you were thinking and feeling and they should just act appropriately. You guys stop communicating. This connection, you guys would always talk to each other about everything. And somewhere along the line, you were like, well, you should be a, a mind reader, so you should know why I'm mad. And then little by little, it just started building and building and building. You guys don't even know what the hell you guys separated for or what the initial argument was about. Okay, it was that whole I thought you were a mind reader energy. What else happened here in the past universe? Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, it's that you what really happened here is that neither one of you guys. How can I put this? Neither one of you guys opened up and communicated or continue nurturing the connection. You automatically expected your person to know what it is that you wanted or how they should move forward towards you. And you, it, it, without, without the communication, there wasn't going to be any forward movement. The one thing that this connection always had was full-blown communication. And I feel that at this point, obviously, it's time to sit down and reignite that conversation. Get the juices flowing again. Start talking again so you and this person can overcome these obstacles and finally recognize where you made the mistakes and come back towards each other because this connection truth be told Aquarius this relationship deserves a second chance it does there is no interference from third parties there's no interference from friends or family members it was just you and this person not communicating okay what is the possible outcome in this connection universe? Archangel, spirit, angel, guides, and guardians. See, there you go. The page of swords. No form of communication. A new clarity. Hangman energy. Releasing the past and accepting what happened. Moving on and moving forward. No longer staying stuck in the situation of the past. Okay? Starting to communicate with each other. Starting to open up with each other. Really give each other some truth and some clarity. Universe, Archangels, Angel Guides and Guardians, Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel Guides and Guardians. Tower moment. So there's a, this connection, first and foremost, it should have never ended. And it's not going to end, okay? But there are some changes that need to be had, okay? I don't think that neither you or your person ever wanted this connection to come apart, nor did you guys want it to end or let alone be separated from each other, okay? But there are some changes that need to happen. You guys need to get back to the good old times, the way things used to be, the way you guys used to communicate to each other, the way you used to open up and say things to each other. It's time to get back to that energy. This connection has so many beautiful possibilities of coming back around but it's time for you and your person to finally put that guard down and have that conversation that is much 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 needed so you guys can overcome these obstacles and move on and move forward in a reunion and a reconciliation all right guys well i hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if you would like to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.